what's up you guys um, it's been a while man hopefully you can hear me okay I, this audio may be absolute garbage but I don't need to be super crystal clear um, to let you guys know what's happening it's, I feel like I think it's been almost a year since I've uploaded you know I'm sorry to leave you guys hanging like that like we uh, we just got the forerunner and then we just disappeared. So, um, but a lot, a lot has changed uh, in the past year. It's crazy. I was kind of waiting for the right time to give you guys an update, and today is that time. <laughs> um, everything uh, that's been happening is kind of uh, coming to a point today, which is why we're driving right now. And I know a lot of you are probably wondering, and we've gotten a few comments of this as well. WRX is obviously fine. It didn't blow up. I know it kind of seemed like that may have happened since, you know, I put all these extra mods, you know, I, I went flex fuel and we hit 380 horsepower, I think a wheel horsepower with the car. Um, and then, you know, shortly after we stopped uploading and all you guys are saying that uh, it was gonna blow. And it hasn't, uh, not yet. <laughs> Everything, Everything's totally fine. Um, I really think this car is gonna last a long time like this. And it all comes back to, you know, if you respect the car, if you take care of the car, it's gonna take care of you. Um, you know, I, I haven't been babying it, but I haven't been trashing it either. So, um, no, the car is doing totally fine. I don't wanna spend too much on this intro. I just wanna get to the video. I know I've already probably spent more time but I do really quickly, as quickly as I can, just give you guys a quick update as to what's been happening in the past year. Kind of the reason I haven't been uploading, so I'm not gonna explain things, I'm just gonna let you know. Um, so the first thing is we moved. Uh, that was probably the biggest thing. We moved out of the house that we were in. We downsized, um, we greatly reduced our rent. We really needed this to save money and just kind of be adults for the first time. Past year, I've also started a business called Hour One Survival. That's been going on, that's been going crazy, um, taking up a lot of my time. I haven't been working, you know, so I, all I'm gonna say is I haven't been working uh, the past like three or four months, so I've had a lot of time on my hands. Um, so, um, and the last thing that I can really think of right now is uh, I'm selling the WRX. Um, some of you guys already know, if you follow us on Instagram, I posted a story. Um, while ago that we were selling the WRX and that's what's happening. I've been wanting to sell the WRX for the past maybe six months now, uh, but I didn't tell you guys about it until the past week or so. That's one of the other reasons I haven't been uploading. Um, it's just because of our situation. It hasn't easily allowed us to upload, it, uh, to upload videos. Um, but, you know, all I can say is the only reason I'm selling the WRX is because it's kind of a necessity at this point. Um, you know, we wanted to downsize, and if we're gonna save money, we're gonna do it right, we're gonna do it big. Um, I need to set myself up right now for the future so that I can have stuff like this in the future because if I just try and hold on to this stuff right now as long as I can, it's not sustainable. And, uh, you know, we kind of came to that realization in the past year where we were just like, we gotta shed as much as we possibly can. And one of the things that I never said I'd sell I, yeah, I have to sell and it really sucked. It was a huge bummer and you know, it's just this thing, I've fallen in love with this car and it's, you know, I don't know if it's really sunken in or if it's just sunken into the point where I'm okay with this at, at, at this point because it's been, you know, six months since we've decided. We finally lined up with a buyer. It just kind of happened really fast uh, and we're driving out right now. As you guys know, we're in you know, Los Angeles, California, and this guy, he's in Idaho. So, <laughs> we're driving the car up to him. Uh, we're gonna stop in Salt Lake City tonight and then finish the drive up tomorrow and meet him up there and do the deal and hopefully everything goes smooth. And, uh, yeah, it's it's really crazy. It's honestly crazy. I still see you still I wish we'd never met. I'm living with the ghost of you.
made it to the beautiful state of Utah. We're in uh, Salt Lake City and uh, it's the next morning. All right, now it's uh, back on the road. We got another three and a half hours until we get to um, Idaho. And we'll uh, be at the bank and we'll do the deal and hopefully be out. So <laughs> let's get it done. Then we're gonna be mobbing back in that car right there. All the way back, another 10 hours, so it's crazy. All right, we are officially in Idaho. It is deserted out here. So today is the last official day, not even full day. I literally have like a couple hours left with the, with the WRX. It's kind of setting in that this is, this is literally the last couple hours I'm gonna have with this car forever. Um, but, you know, it's okay. next chapter um, there's always something bigger and better in the future it's for the best and uh, yeah so that's pretty much it we're gonna close out our trip in Utah and Zion and uh, that's pretty much it so as always guys uh, we are never finished I almost forgot it <laughs> it's been a while we are never finished and we will catch you guys in the next one whatever that is <laughs>